I love anything that have an arctic. I have. <laughs> I couldn't get the word calm. Hey fam, good morning, good afternoon, good night. Depending on the time that you're watching this video, for me it is evening. This is probably like about 6.30. So I'm really trying to film this talk through before the sun goes down. Super warm welcome to any of you who are new here. Thank you so much for clicking on this video and for joining me. I hope that you would stick around or subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell so that you do not miss any of my videos. I have this beautiful top that I created which is the main focus of this video today. This video I think will be very short so I'm just going to be showing you in the cutaway the top. It took me quite a few days to finish this. No not necessarily all day but in between work you know and doing other things I was able to fit in the time to do this and it was like a little learning process for me in a sense because I haven't been sewing regularly and I was talking to my sister about that she also is a designer and she said yes if you I mean like anything else if you do not do something regularly it's very possible that you will be very slow at doing it when you do try to do it again or you may even forget some of the steps so I think this is why it took me so long to get this top completed. Anyway, I didn't give up. I pushed through, took some deep breaths, <laughs> and where I made an error, I just fixed it. I'll insert a few parts of me creating the, the top. Obviously not the entire process, but you will get to see bits and pieces of the process. Overall, I am very happy with the top absolutely love it as most of you all know this is something that i absolutely love to do i'm hoping to get to a point in my influencing career where i can actually quit my day job and focus solely on creating content as well as creating pieces if it's up to me that is exactly what my life would be like um traveling obviously which is one of my most loved things to do traveling, designing, and creating content for you guys. So I love sharing with you guys. So if you have any questions about the creative process, let me know. I'll try to answer as best as I can. This top is made from about three different fabrics. The lining is made from a uh, cotton, very light cotton. The outside is made from a synthetic fiber. I don't remember exactly what that is. And then the underneath of the pleats that goes around I have crinoline I have a bunch of other things that I want to sew and eventually I'll be able to create these pieces or similar pieces for sale but I will not be a situation where I'm creating an abundance of them so probably it'll be made to order I won't be able to have a stack of them <laughs> waiting to be sold so anything that i plan on creating is a possibility i'll be able to recreate for someone else but honestly at this point i cannot say that i'll have the ability to do it right now but that is what i truly would love to be able to do since i returned from barbados i've been trying to get a few videos out to you guys so today this one will be focused on a few accessories that i picked up as well as some bags and some shoes guys Amazon still have me on choke <laughs> like seriously they're taking all my money Amazon is taking my money guys so I'm gonna start with Amazon actually let me start with what I'm wearing right now now you guys already would have seen these this Indachi earring and these are my uh, one side of my butterfly earrings from Zara and this cuff is also from Zara I picked up a pair of earrings from Zara as well Aren't they beautiful? Like, seriously. I decided I'd put one in for you guys right now. They feel a little weighty. I have no idea how they look right now. I'm gonna have to go get my mirror to see. Guys, these earrings are so gorgeous. Like, you will, there's a trend right now where bold, very vibrant earrings are in as well. And the floral, animal insect like there's a trend where you're seeing all these different th types of 
images um, created into earrings and I love that. All right, so that's it from Zara's. Next up is Amazon. There are these gold earrings that I may have showed you guys in the last video. I really love how these are shaped. I had to get them. They're very light and very comfortable as well. So I love them so much that I also picked them up in the silver. I love anything that have an arctic. I have. <laughs> I couldn't get the word calm. I love anything that has an architectural look to it. I figured because these are earrings, I can actually just put them on so you guys can see what they look like. So these ones, I just love. Anything that has this geometric architectural vibe, I absolutely love. So these are the gold. Absolutely love them. So good. You can actually wear them the other way too. So I wore them with the end facing backward, but I can also wear them facing forward like that. <laughs> Next up, guys, I am obsessed. Look at these. So good right so I'm thinking I need everything red like red top these red earrings or a red dress or something just like everything red maybe even the shoes red but the main color is going to be red like a really great monochromatic moment and these oh. I cannot wait. I cannot wait. And I loved those so much that I had to get them in another color. Blue. So blue is also a beautiful accent color. This is the reason why I got these. This is very much trending flowers. You're going to see a ton of different floral styled earrings right now. Like for instance, those yellow ones that I had on in the last video. That's very much a trend. Speaking about accessories, I have these beautiful glasses. I, if you guys wear glasses, Amazon. As, if readers, I mean. Not if you need a prescription, a special prescription. If you wear readers and you got a prescription for your readers, you can actually buy them from anywhere. So this is what I usually do. I go, I get my eyes checked, and I, and I don't do my prescription at the optometrist because they're going to cost a whole lot more. I basically get my reader's prescription, go on Amazon or any other site that have reasonably priced glasses, and that's how I get mine. And these, oh my God, I am so obsessed. There was a black pair, a clear pair, another tortoise shell, and these. So the other tortoise shell is just the regular tortoise shell. It's, it's not quite like this one. This one has like a little clear or pink hue to it while the other one is more like black and brown love them all but on, i didn't plan to show you these but i just realized i should just in case anyone is interested i have all of these items linked in my amazon storefront so please check them out um definitely use my amazon storefront links and of course support your sister thank you <laughs> i think that's it for all of the accessories that i got recently someone kept telling me you need some pumps some regular pumps because I really don't gravitate towards pumps. I started shopping for some. I went to Macy's and picked up these beautiful suede and leather yellow pumps. I love them. The heel I think is about a three and a half to four inches. These are super comfortable so far. I haven't worn them a lot. I only wore them like around the house um, as I did some try-ons. They're super padded on the inside and soft. So I like that. I love anything that's padded. Like I love that. The, in the heel part as well. Love the detailing in the front with the different tones. Beautiful. I will show you guys what these look like on in the cutaway because I actually had them on with this look. I also got these beauties from Amazon guys i have wings 
on my shoes so I can fly out. Love, love, love these so much. Now, they're kind of read like they're silver sometimes, but they are gold. They also come in the silver. I think I should get the silver as well. I absolutely love these I wore these to an event this week with Save the Duck. I did a campaign with them before, and they invited me to their store. They had a cocktail hour there where they were launching their spring and summer collection. Guys, don't sleep on Amazon. Again, these were very comfortable. I was standing like the entire time I was at the event and I only started to feel a little uncomfortable maybe hour or an hour and a half later. So to me, that was pretty impressive. Very comfortable shoes. For reference, I am a nine and a half usually, but I usually size up when it comes to pumps. Anything that has a narrow front, I try to go up and these fit perfect in a nine and a half they actually did not have this in a 10 so i went with the nine and a half next up are my new favorite summer bags <laughs> these are going to be in rotation guys first up from amazon again is this beautiful heart bag isn't she lovely ignore the motorcycle outside but she is stunning i absolutely love it it has a double zipper so it can open up on both sides i'm trying to think if i took anything out of it i don't think i did yeah i didn't and it came wrapped really well so you see this styrofoam this was what was keeping the bag in shape and they also had one under and wrapped around the handle the top handle i was very impressed by the packaging so this is vegan leather when it comes to trends i will say it over and over and over again i will not spend a lot of money on it this bag is a trend right now the heart bags or the bags that have these various you know geometrical shapes like the rounded ones the square ones I think the squares will last a long time, maybe even the round ones. But I think that we are going to start to move away from some of these shapes. Hearts are cute. They're very cute. For me, if it was like a basic shape, like maybe a square, maybe, maybe I could spend extra on it. But not for something that is a trend like this. But absolutely love the color. Did you guys notice how much I love yellow? I've been buying yellow a lot. Yellow, green, pink, and orange. So I'll try to put the prices of these items, all of the items that I'm showing you in the description box or on the screen for you as I show them. Everything else I'm going to show you is from Shein. So guys, I got a few bags from Shein. My Shein bag collection. My Shein summer bag collection to be exact. I'll start with the smallest one. And I'm into smaller bags right now. Unless I'm going to work or the supermarket or something, I don't carry a large bag. It's usually going to be very small. Guys. Guys, I am so obsessed. I think this was like 10 bucks. I mean, look. Just look at the detailing. I promise you, if I had to put a Kalgai label in here, this bag would be maybe a hundred to two hundred dollars maybe even more this bag was about ten dollars guys and i think i got a discount too <laughs> i didn't listen you can just say i stole this bag because i paid literally nothing for this bag. it's so cute and i cannot wait to style it for you guys all right so i hope that i can get this bag styled so that you guys can see what it looks like but if i don't get a chance to, you're going to see it styled in another video. Next up is this beautiful straw bag. I love the size of this. Like, more minis please. I just want these small dainty bags. This is so beautiful. Love the detailing with the beading in front here and then the tassels. Oh my God, this bag is such a vibe. Now, I, could t I would totally rock this in a bigger size though. I would totally rock it in a bigger size, but I wanted the mini size for that for now. 
so beautiful. Again, very reasonably priced. I cannot remember the cost, but I know that I did not buy anything for more than $20. And I think that this may have been like 11 or 12. And once again, I got a discount. Finally, guys, if you can guess the color of the next bag, if you could only guess, what is the first color that comes to your mind? If you haven't sped up the video, then you already know that my favorite color right now is yellow. Yellow and green, like I just said a few minutes ago. Guys, guys, seriously? Shein, Shein, Shein is doing their thing. It is beautiful bag and like, all right, so now these can go one way or the other. You can hang one both sides. I love the tassels hanging down and that it's shaped again like a heart. I guess we're all in love or showing lots of love these days. This is so good, guys. I think this may have been the more expensive bag. And when I say expensive, I don't even think it was $20, but it was the higher of all three bags. So good. All right, guys. I think I've come to the end of the video for now. Like I said, I have a whole bunch of other things that I want to share with you, but I'll do that in a second video. Okay, guys, I had to go put these earrings on again. Really love these earrings from Zara's. You did good, Zara. I haven't really been into wearing white a lot, but this could be worn with different colors, and this could be the accent piece. Zara's have been doing really, really good with their accessories lately. You know, they've come up with the chokers. You now they have these bold, vibrant gold pieces like the cuff. Rings, bracelets, necklaces, you name it, Zara's have you covered. Only problem is I often question the quality of their pieces, so I don't invest much in their accessories at all. I like to wait until they go on sale, and I'm pretty sure that these ones were marked down when I got them. Once again, check the description box for all of the pieces that you saw today, the shoes, the bags, anything that I cannot find, I will try to get you something similar. But I work so hard, we work so hard, us content creators who put out videos, we work really, really hard to create that description box for you. Now, we're not saying that you have to purchase these things, but if we put a link there, especially if it's an affiliate link where we're going to earn some form of commission, it'd be so, so sweet of you to click on that link and use the link. Do not go directly to the website. This is. It's, it's really work and we do it for you because we want to share with you. And sometimes if I forget to share a link, a lot of you will send me a message, leave a comment and ask for the link. And I'm like, oops, I forgot. So I know that a lot of you are looking for some of these pieces or something similar. So if you are on the hunt for anything that I showed you today, please do use my links that are in the description. Um, this is actually Memorial Day weekend and this is the Friday before. It so I'm hoping to have this video up before Memorial Monday. So if you are watching and it's already Memorial Day Monday, I hope that you are having a wonderful day. Do all of the things that make you happy, whether it is relaxing, hanging out, having a barbecue, going to the beach, going to brunch, going to lunch, going to dinner, going to a party, whatever you do. But please, most of all, be safe. I love you all so, so much. And I will see you in my next video. Mm -hmm. Bye, guys.